triple pulleys. This will enable me to create forces of several hundred kilograms, maybe. Initiating. Welcome back to my daily grind. Create yourself is what you'll find me doing every day and every night. No time to lose. One day, one step in the right direction. I'm Chris and I'm only here to show you if I can do it, you can do it too. Welcome back to the vlog. It is Tuesday, another day, another chance to push hard. And the topic for this vlog is my DIY triple pulley. So let's get it. By the way, all the DIY projects right here, watch them all. But before we get started, love goes out to all my subscribers. Thank you for making my life special and worth living to the max. So let me try to give back with a sweet, sweet video. So in my last vlog, you can check it out right here. I took a look at the single pulleys. Also, if you want to know more about the parts, the cost and the assembly, check it out. Well, there is also an assembly for this one. So let's get right to it. I just assembled a single pulley and now let's get to the triple pulley. This is so sick. I think a double pulley, mm, well it could work, but a triple pulley is just so awesome because you have a centered point for the paracord basically as a hinge. If you're interested you will be able to find this on my shop. Now we need of course three of each, three times two ball bearings, which is six. I will also need four plates this time and the assembly is quite a bit more complicated. So the plates are super oily, so I need to clean them, wipe them. So the screws will be these here, I already prepared everything. So let's do this. So I will start with this screw for the rolls, two washers, then the first plate, two more washers, then the first roll. Two more washers, here we go with the next plate. And a locking nut for, for the end. Okay, there we go. Let's get to these long screws. Oh yeah, this, is, this isn't a screw actually. This is a threaded rod that I cut to length and I glued on these locking nuts on one side. They are glued on with super glue. And you can kind of see that there's a bit of glue on the thread. There we go, that was the first one. Locking nut, here we go. Okay, and lastly, the big screw. And this time I will use two washers. Another locking nut, that's it, triple pulley, here we freaking go. So, there it is, all tight and ready to go. Again, I will use three paracords, three loops for, you know, ultra safety. And now that I have two, I can build an awesome pulley system. So, let's get right to it. And now, I have two of them, as you saw. Triple pulleys. Yeah, this will be insane. This will be amazing. There are two ideas for this. First of all, it could be used as a spotting device. Basically mount the rope right here, the other one on the floor and another guy could just, you know, easily pull the weight with only a sixth of the force. And the second one, of course, is to stress test, tensile test my 3D print parts like the archery release aids. And we will actually get to this right now. So let's set up the triple pulley pulley system. So for now I will be using this one as the ceiling mount. All right, there we go, tons of paracord and the second one for the suspended pulley. Let's go. Yeah, six. This should divide the weight by six. So you will only need one sixth of the strength to actually lift something up. If I have six kilograms as a weight, I will only need to pull with one kilogram, theoretically. Okay, so down here, there's the weight. And we're looking at around 13 kilograms. Let's see how much force I will need to lift it up. I should only need two kilograms. So check this out, I can lift it up. When I lift it up, then it will go to almost three. And when I let it go, or when I, you know, relax it a bit, then it will start to go down at around two kilograms. So check this out, it's moving so little and the rope, I have to pull it so far down. But yeah, this will enable me to create forces of several hundred kilograms maybe. It depends on what I can find to actually use on the bottom as a counterweight, but this is super easy and it's, it's so smooth, I love the pulleys. You can actually find this on my shop, first link in the description. Completely DIY, absolutely amazing and smooth. So nice. And by the way, if you're interested in what's coming up next, in my next vlog, you can check it out right here. God damn it, it's right here. I will unbox and test 
and review this crane scale and then in the next vlog I will actually implement it because somewhere in here, actually right here, I can hook up this scale. Well then I can stress test my 3D printed parts and then you know film this the scale and then yeah this will be so much easier than what I did in the past. Insane. The last stress test you can check it out right here. That was that was so insane, so much work. But yeah, that's my triple pulley, it works. I got it right the first try, which is amazing. And this is simply awesome, this is so cool. Okay, anyways, 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 I need to keep it going. I guess I will see you in the next one. Smash the like button the way I kind of smashed my, the last sentences right here. <laughs> I bang the bell like clap, clap, to never miss DIY projects and check the recent news on chrisviral.com. And yeah, that's it for today, I will see you tomorrow.